Are you getting a blurry wallpaper on top of your iPhone that's running iOS 17? So in this quick video, I have a solution for you that should fix your issue and solve the problem where your wallpaper is blurry at the top. I know that this can be frustrating because it doesn't look nice. Maybe it's distracting or something else. Apple has acknowledged that there may be an issue where when you set your own photo or a custom photo from your iPhone's photo gallery, the top of that photo is blurry. This is probably caused by some bug in iOS 17, and Apple is going to release an update that's going to fix this issue. But before they do, I have a little fix for you that should solve this problem. When you want to set a new wallpaper, we're not going to do it in the settings on our iPhone, but instead of that, we'll open our Photos app and then find a photo in here that you want to set as your iPhone wallpaper. For example, I want to set this specific photo as my wallpaper, but I get that blurry problem at the top when I try to set it. In order to fix that, you want to tap on the edit button at the top right corner of your screen, and that is going to open our photo editor. After that, we'll tap on the crop because we will have to crop our photo a little bit. We will then tap on this little icon at the top right, and that's the aspect ratio option. You can see a couple of different ratios that they offer us, but since we want to set this photo as a wallpaper, simply tap on the wallpaper button. This is going to adjust our photo to the correct size. When you do these steps, we can tap on the Done button and our photo is cropped and ready to be set as a wallpaper. In order to set this as a wallpaper, we'll tap on this little Share icon at the bottom left of our screen and then find the Use as Wallpaper option and then go through the steps of setting this photo as a wallpaper on your home screen or lock screen. This little trick should fix the issue and you shouldn't have the blur at the very top anymore. But keep in mind that this maybe won't work with all of the photos from our photo gallery. So if this didn't work for you, make sure you go over to the software update section in the iPhone settings and check if Apple has released any new updates. They should fix this issue in the future iOS updates, so make sure you update your iPhone regularly to the latest iOS version. Also, if you have any other fixes for this problem, make sure to leave them in the comments down below, and I will see you in the next video.